Hi everyone, I am back again with another video on the E46 repair. Uh, today will be a pretty quick one. I'm just going to quickly show you how to remove the hood off your E46. I've, also, I've already uh, just started. I'm removing this good hood off the parts car to go put on the other car. So um, it's not too complicated. It's pretty easy to actually get the hinges off. Uh, the hardest part, I guess, is getting the, uh, the hose and electrical out for the um, the windshield washer sprayer. So I've already pulled one of the clips off over here. I actually broke this one. Um, it's this little clip, see if we can get some light, that uh, goes over the hose and electrical like this. And it's got a piece, that's the piece I broke off here. It's got a piece that wraps around underneath this piece of metal and clips it in there. So I'll show you just on this side, all you need is a saw screwdriver or an X-Acto knife. And slide it in underneath the metal on top of the plastic and just kind of pry out a bit and it'll uh, slide the entire clip off just like that. So I've got it off there and then you need to also disconnect the hose here. The reason why you're unclipping this by the way is to actually get to this electrical and pull it out. So I'm gonna undo that clip there to get the electrical out. And then you also have to undo this hose off this T here. Just twist and pull and it'll come off. And then once I unclip this connector here, I'll be able to slide it all through here. So I'll show you that. As you can see, time. I've gotten all this unclipped and have this electrical unhooked here. I've also unhooked this connector for the other sprayer and the hose. The next thing you're gonna wanna do is the, there's these rubber grommets here. Um, there's a split on them. It's on the back here and on the one over here, it's on the back up here. So you just wanna get your finger in near that slit and pull it out just to get it out of your way. It'll make it a lot easier to pull everything back through. So I'm gonna pull that one off. I've already started both of them, Get that off. And now I should be able to just pull this here and you'll see it's gonna pull the hose and the electrical through the hood. This job would be a lot easier if uh, BMW had put these connectors and the, the a hose tee off or something down here because then you could just disconnect it all down here and you wouldn't have to worry about all this. But anyway, I'm gonna pull this through and then we'll move on to the next. Pulled the hose and the two electrical connectors through. Um, just be careful because it goes from over here all the way over here as we already pulled the uh, grommets off. Uh, just be careful, use your finger and push the connectors through and just go slowly because this is bare metal and you don't want to cut your hose or your connectors. Your next step is you have to undo the, um, the bolts that hold the hood hinges to the hood itself. These are an 11 millimeter. There's also a Torx head in there, but I just prefer to use the hex socket. They're the hex head. Um, so there's one there. This one will actually, you can just loosen it and the hood will slide off of it. Um, and then this one down here holds it as well. Now I'm almost ready to pull off the hood. Um, I'm doing this by myself, so it's a little harder, but uh, it is possible. I'm gonna show you how to do it. If you did have two people, if you had someone else close by, um, it would be a lot easier if you asked them to help because you can have one person on either side to hold the hood as you want to do it. Um, but what I've done so far is I have removed the back bolt, the one down in here, um, and I've loosened the top one on this side, and then I have loosened both on this side. So I'm gonna set it up where I just removed this back bolt, and now that these two top two are loose, uh, the hood just should slide off it. So I'm gonna record me doing that, and you can okay, see what so I mean. With the back bolt on that side removed, I'm going to come over here and remove the, uh, remove the back bolt on this side. Again, the front two are still there, but they're just on loose. Um, I'm gonna adjust my hands here. There we go. So I'm, make sure you keep your hand holding the hood up here. I've gotten that bolt out now, so now it's resting on the top two, which are somewhat loose. I'm going to try and slide it up. It may or may not work, because I might not have them loose enough. Yep, that one's coming. That one I need to loosen a bit more. So just keep your hands up on the hood to keep it there. You don't want it to bend on you. This one just needs to loosen a bit more. Yep, there we go. It's loose now. So now I'm just going to come under here, lift up both sides, and you'll have the hood off. Okay, as you can see, the hood is now off. Um, if you're doing this by yourself, just make sure you have a nice place that you can easily set this down, like some sort of table or something, or set up a couple chairs, I don't know, whatever works for you in your space, because um, you just don't want to place that hood down on the paint and 
ruin it. But that is uh, all for this video, a little bit of a shorter one. But uh, thanks for watching and have a good day.